Hi everyone, it's Melissa from The Hunk Strap. I'm here today on the 10th day of our 12 Days of Christmas Song Challenge to teach you how to play Happy Christmas, War is Over by John Lennon. Um, before we get started, you're going to want to go to that uh, description box where you'll find a free downloadable PDF tab so you can follow along with me. I will also throw the cords up here in one of the corners so that you can follow along with me if you're on your phone or tablet and don't have access to a printer. Um, this song is in three quarter time, so if you've been following along with the challenge, you've already done this a few times, you should have it pretty well mastered by now. But if you're just coming in and just wanted to learn this song and you're like, oh crap, I've never done that before, um, we do have an easier song that only has three chords. It's Silent Nights, the one I did on the day right before this one. Um, so you can feel free to go check that out first and make sure you've got the, the strumming down and mastered um, before you move on to this one because it has a few more tricky chords in it. Um, also, so, well, actually, let's just talk about the three-quarter strum. So it's going to be a down, up, down, up, down strum. And with three-quarter time, you are putting more of an emphasis on that first beat rather than the two that follow it. So I'm going to make an A chord to start because that's our first chord. And it's an A. So we're going to go down. Down strum makes more of an emphasis, so it's down, up, down, up, down. You can even like, if you want to play with the dynamics a little bit, you can make it louder for the down strum and do the up, down, up, down strums a little softer. So down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, and that's our strum pattern throughout the whole song. Now. In terms of parts, um, it's hard to break down exactly what is, what's going on. It's not like a tra traditional um, verse, chorus, bridge, any of that stuff. So he kind of has like a first part. I'm going to call it the intro part. Um, or he sings the So This Is Christmas part because it's different from everything else um, that follows. So let's we'll just break it down into that first part, and that's what we'll call it part one when we go to look at the chords I'm throwing up here so you know which ones to follow along with. Okay, so we're gonna start with an A. Um, and so this is Christmas. your index finger along the second fret and putting your ring finger on the third fret of the A string or you can make the alternate which is to make a D chord and lift up your middle finger. Either one will work. I'm going to go with the traditional one. Um, Merry Merry Christmas G. Just for the sake, I'm going to call this, you know, the first part is part one, this is going to be part two. The next part we're just about to do is part three. Now this part, um, there is the lead vocals and there's also a chorus singing above him. They're singing, war is over. So the first time through, I'm going to attempt to sing both parts, which is kind of difficult, just so you know where they come in in case you want to sing this with somebody else. And then I'm going to run through it one more time without singing that second part so that you can clearly hear what I'm doing. All right. So we're going to an E7. And so this is Christmas morning. It's all of a weekend full strong. If you want a rich and the poor one, it is all. The road is so long. All right, so let's do that one more time without me singing that extra stuff. And so, so, and so. that 
second part, I guess we're calling it part two, the D7. A merry, merry Christmas and a happy new year. Let's hope it's a good one without any fears. So you're in that E, and then we're going to go to that E7. And so this is Christmas. Start with an A. So I would call that that part the outro, and you can repeat that as many times as you wish until you finish the song. Um, and end it on an A. I think that would be fine. That seems to be how it ends. Um, <laughs> but of course we can always be a little creative to put our, our own little license on that. Um, anyway, so if you have any questions, please put them in the comments uh, box below. Um, if you like this video, please hit like and subscribe. It does help out my channel. It also helps the YouTube algorithm kind of know that it's content worth serving to other people. So that way I get new followers. So it really does help me out. Um, and I think that's it. Um, if you haven't checked out all the other videos from this challenge, they are also in the description box where there are links and you can go and check them all out so that you can have a very, very merry holiday season and, uh, and play some songs for your friends and family or yourself, whoever, your dog, your cat. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for listening. See you next time. Bye.